Hey everyone, Jonathan Silva here from Pragmatic Works. This time we're going to talk about the best and fastest way to access a single file in SharePoint using Power BI. Let's jump right in. All right, so here you have it. This is my SharePoint site that has my document library that I want to go ahead and access. The one file I want is right here, accounts data for today. That's it. I just want the single file. So I want to pull that into my Power BI report without having to get everything that's currently in this document library, then filter through and choose which one I want. In order to do that, the fastest, the easiest way to do this is we're gonna go ahead and select the ellipses here for that individual file and go all the way down to details at the bottom. From your details, we could just scroll down and choose the path. That's it, that's all we need. That's the direct link that we need to the path of this file. Now we can use this direct path inside of Power BI when we wanna go bring that file in. So I'm gonna come here to Power BI all right, so we wanna come here to get data, and instead of pointing to SharePoint Online or our SharePoint list, we're gonna go instead to the web option. If I click on web, all I need to do is paste in that URL that we've just captured via our path. You can see here it does point to, to our document library. It's going to my SharePoint site. You can see all that in here. I can just select okay. It may ask me to go ahead and access this web content. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure I am signing in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. All right, now that I'm signed in, I can go ahead in here and select connect. And let's take a look. There you have it, the individual file, just the one file and the one sheet that I wanna access from that file. Now I have my options here at Power Query. I can go ahead and transform data, open up Power Query, make any changes to this data that I want, or directly just load it here inside of Power BI. And you will notice here, this is a quite a small one, but you will notice that what I have here should absolutely match what I have in my SharePoint document library if I just go ahead and open up that file itself. There you are. It's the exact same table I'm seeing here in SharePoint that I have in my preview here for Power BI. If I wanna go ahead and open up Power Query just to have that visual validation, you could see right away that we now have access to the entire table coming from that worksheet all in that single file from SharePoint. As you can see, it's really fast, really easy to go ahead and access a single file in SharePoint on a document library just by using the file path and pointing to that web URL rather than going in and pointing to SharePoint as our connector, getting every document in that folder and then figuring out which ones we wanna filter out or not, right? Both methods are available to us. Now you just have the fastest, easiest way to get that single one. Thanks for joining me here once again. Stay tuned for more videos from myself and all of us here at Pragmatic Works.